Have you ever wondered what would happen if you only watered your plants once a month? Let's test this against various planters to find out. For the control group, let's use the good old self-watering planter. For the first test group, let's see what would happen in the tomato bucket. And for the second test group, let's use a plain five gallon bucket with drainage. Each soil group was given exactly one scoop of Osmocote fertilizer, which was gently massaged into the soil. Genetically identical clones were prepared ahead of time and planted with mycorrhizal fungi to maximize growth. For the final test group, we will try the Cracky method, also inoculated with mycorrhizal fungi for giant roots. Each soil group was watered thoroughly to ensure full saturation. The Cracky group was given a big scoop of Maxi Grow, which was dissolved with pressurized water. The tomato bucket also utilizes a five gallon reservoir filled with only plain water up to the drainage hole. Our buckets are pre-drilled one inch above the handle for your convenience. The soil cup was then placed on top of the reservoir. The soil cup will passively wick water up, reducing the watering to just one or two times per month. Over time, roots will grow into the water, which will allow the plant to drink plenty of water. Each soil specimen was given one last watering to ensure maximum water saturation. We won't water these plants again for a full 30 days. What do you think will happen? Share your prediction in the comment below.